What is going on guys? It is the Phantom Michael and I'm bringing you the next episode of our Pokemon Sword Nuzlocke Challenge. If you guys have not seen the last episode, be sure to go back and check it out. We got ourselves some new Pokemon to add to the team. But with that, we're going to do a quick team recap really quickly and we're going to get started. So up first we have our starter Pokemon Agent, the Sobble. Sobble is rocking out with new Pound, Growl, Water Gun, and Bind. Up next we have Blimp Bug the uh, blimp bug we decided not to name some of these new pokemon just because we're trying to get familiar with who they are so i went ahead and made the executive decision not to nickname everyone so uh blimp bug is rocking out with struggle bug then we have the next pokemon on the team which is scorvit i believe that's how you say it squovit scorvit squovit with tackle tail whip and bite so that is what we have there so let's go ahead and keep going off to Grandmother's house. We have caught every Pokemon up to Route 2. I wonder if we can backtrack, actually. That is a great question. Can we go back and encounter um, in that... Uh, probably not. I'm not even going to waste time because I, I have a huge feeling that you can't. I doubt you can. Not even going to try. Um, we've been in every house. We got pretty far until we backtracked. Yamper, there is Galorian Zigzagoon in the grass as well, um, as well as the uh, Hooked Ears. What is that thing, dude? Oh, man. Choo a Choodle. A Choodle? The hell? Watch out. Oh, man. That would have been cool, too. Is this thing water type? Rock type? Something. It's got to be water type. It is water type. Dude, get yourself an early, an early water type right here. Choodle, man. Freaking Choodle. And he's got a freaking turtle. Dude, I love him, dude. Oh my god, I wish I had him. I already have a water type. I wish it was just pure or something. Don't make me pop my berry now. This thing is going, dude. Ooh. Popped in the berry, man. Popped in the berry, man. Got him. All right, Chugal. Yeah. Blimp Bug level six. All right, I'm out that that patch of grass. I think we're okay. I think we're okay. All right, I see the wee lad. We're gonna heal. Whatever. We're gonna heal. I ain't gonna keep running back every time I feel nervous. Whatever. Let's do it. What is that? I hope that thing stays. I hope that thing stays. Scorbit. I thought you got me in a Scorbit. A Scorbit. Alright, water gun it is. Wow, that did a lot. Come on there, Sobble. There you go. They got the squalvic. Defeated Jake right there. No worry, Jake, it's alright. Alright, what is this thing, dude? What is this freaking thing? What is this thing, dude? What is this freaking thing, dude? Oh my goodness, dude. What is that thing, dude? I, I just had to snap a picture, dude, just because I. Man. What is this freaking Pokemon, dude? And why can't I add it to the team? That is crazy, dude. Is it fire type, I wonder? Let's find out. I think it's fire type. Took that. Took that. Really interesting. What is this, dude? That's 
Dude, I call that thing Naruto, dude, right off the bat. That is a Pokemon right there. That is awesome. Dang, that's such a cool Pokemon. Two potions. There's another one. There's something else in there. Grass too. There, okay, random encounter, let's see. Okay. Blood blood random encounter. Interesting. Interesting. We can even run. Dude, I wonder what that thing shiny looks like. Three more Pokeballs. Dude. I would love... Man. Man, oh man. Last Lorne. Trudel coming out. Agent Sonic. Fight one pound. Tackle again. First can get worse. Gonna just keep going at it, man. Keep on going. Shootle. It's a chewy turtle. I get it now. Chewy turtle. Chewtle. Cool. Down he goes. There we go. Anything else? Any other strange Pokemon? Nope, not yet. We got a battle that weird little boy right there. Oh, um, do I need to heal? Anybody? Probably a good idea. Alright. I know it kind of seems like I'm only using Sobble, but I gotta get some better stuff on some of these other guys, dude. I love the freaking sweater. It looks cool. Okay, perfect. I'm gonna switch right over to um, Squirrelbit. He's got a lot of HP, dude. 28 HP for like a level 7. It's pretty interesting. Didn't mean much. But lowered my special attack. A cheeky little fella. Cheeky little fella. Get him! Get him, squirrel! Don't let him take you alive. Dude, this thing is doing a massive amount of damage onto your special attack. Cool. Alright, we dropped the blip bug. We dropped the blip bug. Ooh, I didn't even catch the name of that. Uh, so I think it, I think it's that little rack, that little fox. Pretty sure I caught the name. Little fox. Nicky. Yep, the little fox. Nicky. It looks like it's gonna be a ground type. Look at that tail in the back. Quick attack. But another Firefox, would they really do that though? With Vulpix? Hmm. Would they really do that? Hmm. Hmm. Good question. Gotcha, Benjamin. Yeah, 420. I'll take the money. Did I see something? Oh, there's something over there. Repel. Uh huh. All these squirrels. Thought I seen something unique. Thought I seen something unique. Cool. 
anything else over here. What are those? Dude, look at the freaking Maracuda Pokemon. Oh, I can fish, dude. Oh! Dude. Female Magikarp. Cool. Super cool. Um... change routes, I don't think. That's what I was worried about. I was like, is it a new route? Look, there's a professor. So, have you unraveled all the secrets of the Dynamax phenomenon yet? Oh, goodness, no. The whole thing is still full of questions. I have hoped that my granddaughter would take over my research, but... Dear me, I'm sorry. I didn't even notice my guests. My name is Magnolia. Welcome, young trainers. Now come, let's head indoors. Why, Hope, dear? I see Wulu has made some new friends. And you must be Phantom. I trust you received the Pokedex from Sonya. I'm sure you'll have it completed in no time. You must already know about Dynamaxing, right, Phantom? Professor Magnoli has been doing research into the Dynamax phenomenon for years and years, and it takes a proper understanding of the thing if you plan on using Dynamax to the fullest. There you go again, Leon, always talking about Pokemon. There are other things that are worth knowing about, too, you know? Like how many different types of tea there are. Hey, Professor, do us a favor, would you? Help me convince Lee he should endorse us for the gym challenge. Oh, Leon. Why wouldn't you endorse them? Hope and Phantom only just started out as Pokemon trainers. There's still loads they don't know yet. Deary, I thought your dream was to have everyone in the gallery region become strong. Trainers, isn't that right? Well, yeah, you're not wrong. That goal is precisely the reason I gave them both Pokemon, in fact. Right then. In that case, how about this? Let's see if you two of you can show me such a brilliant battle that I'm left with no choice but to endorse you. And don't worry, I'll make sure your teams are in good shape before the battle starts. What are they just... Oh, they healed us. I was like, what the hell are you doing? Right, I'll be waiting outside, Phantom. Alright, so we're about to battle again. Can I go in here? I'm gonna snoop. I'm gonna snoop. Some of these are collections of Professor Riley's research. All of it. Cool. Well, I wonder if this is uh, a dryer, a hair dryer and a hairbrush have been left lying around without being put away. This could be, um, there are some scientific journals of fashion magazines mixed in among all the old books. There's everything you can need for the latest in training makeup looks. There's some Yamper stuff. It looks like, is that a Butterfree? That's a Butterfree and a Zubat picture right there. Very well done. Is there anything over there, like, super secretive? Can't really see. I'd have to zoom in. Um, okay, cool. So I'm su assuming that's, uh, Sonya's old room. Back there. Anything over here? Can I come back here? Ooh, look what I found. Whoa. Oh, look what I found. Yo. Payback TM. Sweet. Okay. Cool. That was cool. I hope everyone finds that. That's cool. And there's a Pokemon over here. Dude, look at these freaking lights, man. Look at the coloring of this game, dude. Whoever said this game? Someone said... Oh, and there's a hidden item right here. Auto fresh water. Nice. Someone, someone said this game was not all that, dude. Y'all need to rethink your lives, man. This game is sweet. Hurry up, Phantom. You've got to battle me so I can get myself that endorsement. Dude, you're on, bro. I'm going to become the greatest Pokemon trainer there is. 
And to do that, I need that endorsement to take part in the gym challenge. Come at me with everything you have so we can prove to Lee that we've got what it takes. All right, dude, you're on. I'm rather interested in seeing how you two young trainers battle too. Listen, you two, the reason I'm unbeatable is because I learn from every battle I see or take part in. That's how I've gotten to where I am today. So show me something good in this battle. It's time for my legend to begin. Let's get it, bro. How many Pokemon do you got now? You're a challenge with Pokemon trainer? Alright, let's go, bro. Let's go. Alright, we'll do it first. Okay, so you got three Pokemon. Okay. Three Mons, three Mons. Dude, I don't even know if I even want to. Hmm. Oh, dude, I'm a smoky, bro. That's fine, dude. Go ahead, move the tackle. Do three damage. I thought I overloaded for a minute. Got him. What are you gonna do? I got a level 8 Scorbit. Oh, are you gonna throw a score you right now? They're just gonna sweep you, bro. I didn't even think I over leveled. Oh, I kinda, I mean, I guess I kinda defeated every Pokemon I ran into. So I guess. But look at you, seeing you've already learned your type matchups. Have a taste of our true power. Our flames are burning bright. Oh, for a minute, I was like, he's gonna, he's gonna die to max. That was a crit, okay. Huh? Cool. Score one is down. Who's your newest Pokemon, dude? That's what I want to know. Rook a D. Rook a D. berries. And for a second I thought you were gonna give me some problems with looking you. Sobble sweep. Sobble sweep. Cool. Everybody get equal? Nope. The battling Pokemon gets a little more. Water pulse? Dude. Yeah. Yeah, I'll learn water pulse. Uh, I'm just gonna get rid of Bind, dude, just because. Got Bind and Thunder Water Pulse, cool. I'm gonna blunt bugs in to evolve soon. Oh, gutted that I lost, but I'd expect nothing less from my rival. Sweet. And I even got my Pokeball thrown perfect, too. The sting of defeat and the joy of victory. I guess going through both is the key to the two of us getting stronger, right? Phantom Hop. Well, after seeing a match like that one, I suppose I have little choice but to give you both an endorsement as champion. And the letter endorsement. Sweet. You put the letter endorsement in the key I just bought. Yes. Thanks, Lee. I swear I'm going to win my way through the gym challenge to reach you. You may both be young still and plenty of rough around the edges, but it was a proper battle. Charge and I were both feeling the excitement in every last cell in our bodies. Hope you've always tended to get caught up in things like how you throw your Pokeball out, things that I have nothing to do with real strength. Honestly, I've been worried about you still obsessing over that sort of nonsense. But it seems you really have grown a bit, little brother. And I'd like to see some more thrilling Pokemon battles out of you too, Phantom. Alright, Phantom. You and me are going to up to the train up against one another to aim for the champion's title. The more we keep battling against one another, the more our Pokemon will grow. Huh? What's that? What was that? Whoa. What is that? Phantom. Would you look at this? There are wishing stars. 
Since there are two of them, you should take one for yourself. You should just what the hell is that? A stone found in the gallery region with a serious power. It said your dreams come true if you find one. With one of these, my Pokemon can Dynamax. They're gonna be massive. Whoa. Trust you to pull something like this. The way wishing star fall down those who have a true wish in their heart, you know? I will be the strongest trainer ever. I will be the strongest trainer ever. I will be the greatest trainer ever. There. I've said it three times, so surely my wish will come true now, right? Don't be silly, Hop. Those wishing stars are composed of a curious sort of rock containing unknown power. They are one of the most precious resources we have here in the Gallery region. But they won't do a thing for you in that state. Give them to me now and I'll have you sorted. Oh, right. You've done heaps of research on the Dynamax phenomenon, haven't you, Professor? And please, give Phantom and me the power to Dynamax our Pokemon. First, we got to battle against that mad Pokemon in the Slumbering World, and now this... I, I, it really feels like we're getting caught up in the adventure of a lifetime. I do understand your excitement, young man, but don't get carried away. You want to save your energy for tomorrow's journey. Seems I came back home right in time for all the excitement. Hey, you lot. Why not have some dinner? You must be hungry, right? I've been totally obsessed with making the latest Trini curries. Do they even make curries in the UK? Hmm. Good question. It's morning at last, and time for our adventure to truly start. Good morning to you, young challengers. Hope it is true you really met some Pokemon you didn't recognize. Is there anything more you can tell me about it? Alright, well. There was a weird heavy fog and then this even weirder Pokemon up here. Phantom tried to fight it off, but then I think we both passed out or something. It was pretty hazy. A right font of information you are. Phantom Hop, these are for you. What did she just give us? You got a Dynamax man from Professor Magnolia and slipped it on your wrist. Dude. Cool. Those are your Dynamax bands. I made them by fitting the wishing star you found last night into those bands. Thanks, Professor. This is brilliant. It's just like the one Lee has on him, too. Now we can Dynamax our Pokemon like he does. My word, you don't waste any time, do you? I think you'll find it's not so simple as that. You are a number of conditions you must meet if you hope to have your Pokemon Dynamax and take on that gigantic form. Now, don't be afraid to go to all sorts of places and meet all sorts of Pokemon. That will help you fill out your Pokedex, too. The legend of my region is finally about to begin. Come on, Phantom. I'll beat you to the station. Cool. Dude, auto saves too. One last thing before we race, Phantom. See, I've got some great advice for you. You know how you sometimes see Pokemon wandering about out of the tall grass, yeah? If you move real slow like and crouch down, those Pokemon won't pay you any notice. But on the other hand, if you whistle at them, you'll be sure to catch their attention. If you're a bit rubbish at whistling, just remember this. Need a fail-proof trick? Press the left stick. Try it out and let's see who can catch the most Pokemon, Phantom. Hmm. You remember Wedge her station, right? Where we went to pick up Lee before. That'll be the goal. See you there. Okay. Cool. Freaking Sea Dogs too, man. That's awesome. That is awesome. I wonder if it'd be easier to shiny hunt with Pokemon that are like. Hmm. We're gonna think about shiny hunting later. We'll think about shiny hunting later. Yamper. Oh! I totally thought that was her Yamper. That completely just kicked my whole Pokemon are gonna randomly be out in the open thing. Yeah, we ain't dealing with this. 
The amper's a little bit too BA first. That totally kicked my whole hypothesis out the water right there. Hmm. Did I even? That's super interesting. Did I completely miss this path? No, 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 there's a poke wall up there. I remembered. I remembered. A chewel. Dude, there's so much frost. Gosh. Be a shiny. Nope. That'd be nice though. A shiny right off the bat would've been super crazy. I don't want to get overloaded anymore though. Okay. Back to the train station we go. Wedgehurst, is there any way that I can catch a Pokemon here? Is there any way? Ooh, there's, there's an item. Got a revive, totally useless, but I got one. Anyway. Come on, Phantom. You'll never beat me to the station at this pace. Guess I did not. Guess I did not. So, out with it, Phantom. How many did you catch? I caught a really special one, and you got... Not one? What were you doing this whole time? You're going to want a team if you're a trainer. Sweet. Cool. Nice. I know how I'm teaching Swift you. With a team like that, you can teach your Pokemon a new move in a flash. And you can use them again and again too. That one catch teach the move Swift? Lee gave it to me ages ago and now it's yours. The gym challenge will begin at Moto Stoke. And our train's waiting, so let's go. Dude, we're already off to the next city, man. My goodness, not quite so fast, you two. Oh, it's Mom! What are you doing here, Mom? I knew this day was coming since the moment you chose Score Bunny as a partner, darling. Professor Magnolia was kind enough to let us know that you two were setting out. So here, a last little gift to see you well set on your way. All the kit you'll be needing for camping. Oh, cool. Set of camping gear. You put the set of camping gear in your Pokemon key items bag. No matter what happens out there, if you and your partner are together, I know you'll be fine. Thanks, Mom. And just think how lucky you are, Mother, to the first ever pair of champion brothers. Because I'm certain to be the champion next. You'll see. Of course you will be, darling. Anyway, do you do have fun and take care of yourselves. You'll be welcome back home anytime. Wish us luck. Not that we'll need it. There are loads of brilliant trainers and all kinds of Pokemon out there waiting for us. My excitement's running ahead of, of me even faster than the train can go, Phantom. Come on, we're off. Dude, I'm so ready, bro. Motosoke is surrounded by a vast wild area. It's a real sight. There are all sorts of wild Pokemon just wandering about everywhere you look. Plus, you can camp out, do a spot of fishing. I don't think I could ever get tired of it. Plus, you can camp out. Hmm. I like it, dude. What is it? Hey, Mr. Station Master, isn't this a wild area? What are we stopped here for? Yes, this is a wild area station, make no mistake. I'm sorry to tell you that the train is halted due to a flock of wooloo on the tracks. What's there to be sorry about? It, this is brilliant. This wild area is massive. There are loads of Pokemon to battle here. You get it, don't you, Phantom? This is the best possible place to put together the greatest team. All right, then. Hey, have you... Have you and Eevee had a... I knew it. 
you had a Let's Go experience with Eevee, haven't you? I hope you have another Let's Go experience with this with this Eevee too. What? I guess because I played it. Okay. Oh, what am I calling this thing, dude? I ain't gonna call it nothing, dude. I don't know. I ain't gonna call it nothing. If especially if you know you should definitely Dynamax it. Dude, I got both Pikachu and Eevee from the Let's Go stuff. Okay. Sweet. Because I have both, and that's a female Pikachu, and because I had both of uh, Let's Go Pikachu, or Let's Go Eevee and Let's Go Pikachu, um, it gave us both. So, cool. That's awesome. So that's where you get those at. Cool. Got five Poké Dolls. What do you got, man? You got Poké Balls. I'm gonna get five more. For 30. Well, let me get 10 more. To be sure. Alright. And we're gonna go ahead and end it here, guys. On the very end of the third episode, you guys see where you guys can get the Let's Go Pikachu, Let's Go Eevee exclusive Pikachu and Eevee for Dynamaxing. So there it is right there, you guys. Um, I might have to cut the video and just show you guys that that's where you get it at. So who knows? But um, yeah, there you go. So if you guys enjoyed this episode, please smash that like button. Your support is always greatly appreciated. But with that, I've been the Phantom Michael. I'm going to get the heck out of here. I will see you guys in the next one.